Hey guys, and welcome back to Skies of Arcadia. When we last left off, we were exploring the Dark Rift, and we kind of got a little bit lost. However, I know where we're going now. I say, with utmost optimism, or something. Right, what do we have this time? Got some Scourge on the board, that's fine. Let's get Ika to do her stuff. Like a champion. Lovely. An utter victory. Okay, not bad. Not bad at all. We seem to be pretty much re reliably getting uh, 510 gold per fight, which, you know, that's cool. That's a grand per two battles. So let's see what lies within. Uh, ooh. We have a save point. We were this close to a save point. I mean, really? Son of a bitch. That's the way the game goes, though. You're always so close. Uh, did we did that actually save? It did now. Excellent. Cool. Yeah, so close and yet so far. Now this place looks pretty, doesn't it? Ooh, oh, ah. I think I remember that thing. Well, that is one ugly mofo. Kind of looks like it's got a nutsack hanging from its chin. That's fine. Ooh. Oh, dude, look at that thing. What, what is that thing? I don't know, but it's probably... <laughs> but this is probably its home. And it doesn't look like it's going to let us leave without a fight. Um, yeah. So, okay. Uh, I have no real memory of this fight, to be honest. We do need to stock up on some gear grease, because we're getting a little bit low. Uh, let's pop some magic. Let's get some Ingram loaded. And maybe some quicker. Sure, I guess. Looks like we're at a standoff here. This is cool. I mean, obviously, it's a stationary enemy. Although the Delphinus is moving slowly by the look of things. Hope, hopefully we're like strafing or something. If that's something that the Delphinus can do. Such a cool looking ship. Right, Ingram, let's buff. I think it's going to strike. Preparing attack. Come on, you big ugly bastard. Look at that thing. Let's use some quicker. I guess it's just gonna like lurch out and attack us or something. Oh! Poison spray. Wasn't expecting that. Okay. Baze, we're awaiting orders. Tell us what to do, Captain. Uh, let's stay put and keep shooting. I mean, it's not really doing a huge amount of damage to us. We might take some damage, but stay put and keep shooting at that thing. Good idea. If we move around too much in this place, it's so dark that we might lose sight of our target. Yeah, something like that. Uh, so we've barely taken any damage, you know. Uh, and we are still incrimed. Give it a standard cannon. Then warm its uh, ball bag up with that thing. And then we will pop a deluxe kit. And I guess we'll pop some gear grease as well. Let's see what the cannon does to this thing. Alright, so it doesn't have like the world's, you know vastest pool of health, which is good. It's preparing for another attack, which is fine. There we go. 
Let's get the moon cannon off. Good night, wretched beast. Well, if it doesn't kill it, it should do an obscene amount of damage. Yeah, okay. Okay, it did tank that. It's like it's got like a pumpkin on its head or something. And again with a poison spray. That's fine. We can heal all of that in the next turn anyway. Yes, it's preparing it to attack again, which is fine. Yep. Deluxe kit. Gotta love those Deluxe kits. They're not quite obsolete yet. Far from it. Wait, did I pop two Deluxe kits? Bugger. One of those should have been a gear grease. Well, that's okay. We've got plenty of SP anyway, so we're all good. We're all good. Look at that thing smiling. Smiling right at us. What a wonderful target. It's doing something. And now it's got more teeth. Look, it's coming out of the vortex. It looks like our attacks forced it out into the open. Now's our chance. Yeah, okay. I mean, I guess we're just going to volley loads of firepower at it. Because why not? Uh, we should be able to pretty much soak any damage that it does to us. Uh, I guess we'll give it a torpedo as well. We can also use that. Although, we're going to want some gear grease. We're not going to get the option. We're not going to get the option, actually, to use our cannon next turn regardless of what we do, so that's fine. Oh, ho, ho. it doesn't like that. No, sir, it does not like that. I mean, I suppose at the end of the day, it's just a giant fish thing. But if we're going to be making the Dark Rift a safer place, so be it. Luckily, poison doesn't really do much against the uh, Delphinus. Especially as we've battened down. Get those torpedoes out. Should have hit it with another attack, really, but we need as much. Yeah, I mean, that tickled it. We need as much SP as we can get. Uh, it's using evasive action anyway, so it's a good chance we would have missed. And now it's hiding back in the hole. Great, it went back inside. Oh well, I was hoping we could pull off a few more shots before it decided to hide again. Well, that's fine. Vase, we're awaiting orders. Tell us what to do, Captain. Uh, we're going to... Hmm. Stay put and keep shooting. That's fine. Uh, so we can use our cannon next turn if we need to. But to be honest, we're probably going to be able to finish it off here. Wow. We can really spread the damage out with that thing. Should be able to finish it off. Fingers crossed. Ah, oh, right. So we're gonna. I guess we're gonna miss like every turn that we fire into that void. That's kind of sucky. Yeah, it's gonna hide. Bugger! What a wasted turn that was. Son of a bitch! And we're not gonna be able to use our weapon either. But that's fine because we finish it off with cannons. Come back out and fight, you big ugly fish. I mean, honestly. Poppy's going to have you on the fryer very soon. Be eaten for days with that thing. Oh, 
Okay, I mean, that hit. So, that's fine, I guess. Ooh, bite. Eh, it doesn't really hurt that much, actually. Surprisingly so. Base, we're awaiting orders. Tell us what to do. Uh, stay put. Let's go all in. Yeah, we're going to go all in, guys. Uh, we only have 8 SP, though, which is really bad. So maybe... We'll use... Uh, what items do we have? I guess the only thing we can really do is hit it with the advanced cannon. And then we'll just gear grease. Gear grease and Dulux kit. Yeah. That was a good amount of damage for our first volley, to be fair. Should have just stacked as many spirit points as we could have whilst it was hiding. Oh no, we're still hitting it actually. Alright, so it didn't hide. That's fine. Would have been more satisfying to punch through it with a cannon, but hey. Not bad. 54,000 gold and a lot of XP. Looks like Baze is going to level up. Happy with that. Whoa, Concussion Bomb, Timing Valve, and Heavy Torpedo. Nice. Alright, let's repair the damage. Because the old Dolphinus there did take a hit or two. Uh, right. Let's get this uh, ship shape in Bristol fashion. Now, what upgrades did we actually find for this ship? Uh, we got a Heavy Torpedo. Look at that, attack is 800. And the hit, I guess, is just like a guaranteed ha hit. Uh, heavy Torpedo, uh, it's less accurate. And it does take more spirit points. But it does do a little bit more damage. Um. Hmm, do we go, well, I mean, it's only, like, slightly less, I guess. Same firepower as the main cannon, but lower accuracy. Ah, sure. I suppose we'll go for it. Uh, we also got some other equipment, didn't we? So we've got the turbo kit. Ooh. That puts our quick and dodge up by a lot. Standardized valve timing to stabilize engine exhaust, increasing ships quick. Yes, happy with that. And I keep pushing the wrong bloody button. What else have we got? I think that was it, yeah. Okay, we got another, like, bomb or something, but that's fine. Anyway, let's get the heck out of here. We've been here for long enough. Hopefully there's no more of those fish worms. Oh, this looks pretty similar to the way we came in now, doesn't it? Is there any? Doesn't look like there's a safe station though. Oh well. Let's power on through. Guess we're going to be aiming for this thing. Yep. Nice. That's the Dark Rift navigated. We did it. We actually made it through the Dark Rift. Of course we did. Well, I can't believe that we're actually going to be able to see what lies east of the Dark Rift. We're making history as we speak. Of course. Well, we do have the ship for it, after all. Yeah, so that's that. That's the Dark Rift past. Excellent. So no one from our side has been this side for many, many decades. If ever since the planet was destroyed. Okay. What do we have here? 
A Grost. Well, let's go for the Grost. Ika, can you work your magic? Let's see if her abilities are still effective on these strange creatures from beyond the rift. Uh, yeah. Yeah, still effective. Good to know Ika can still commit mass genocide. That is what we like. Ooh, fish. Well, there's a decent amount of fish there as well. Okay. Now, there's obviously going to be um, discoveries and whatnot on this side. Because, of course, there is. We're in a whole new area. A new exciting area. The Dark Rift. But, we'll explore those another time. What have we got? Ah, we got these things? These things are here too? Ugh, of course they are. I don't think uh, Ika's attack was that good against these, so let's just charge with everything we have. Uh, and I'm going to change you to purple, Vase, just because you've already maxed out your red magic. Although... We need somebody learning... Is it, oh, everybody's learned yellow, apparently. Apart from Vase. Um, that's fine. Blue. Let's get Vase using blue, then. That's fair enough. I'll try and spread out some experience. This looks interesting. Oh! Oh! We found the Ignusi's nest, whatever the hell that is. Although this bird builds its nests in rock faces, for some reason they always travel northwards to human civilizations to raise their young. That is why sailors have learned to recognize these nests as signs that a human city is nearby. Well, that's comforting to know. Uh, I guess what we could do, I suppose... Is make some discoveries whilst we're on the way? Maybe? I mean, we're on our way to where we need to be anyway, so we might as well knock some off on the way. Sure, why not? I think we get our ship upgraded where we're going. Ooh, hello. Well, this is fancy. Guardian rules, eh? Very nice. Well, definitely have the guardian walls. Why not? Massive fortress built by an ancient Yaf uh, Yafo Yafoto man. Yafutu man, king. Yafutu man king. Rather than a form of defense, the walls were said to have been built so that lookouts could spot enemy ships before they got too close to the city they were trying to defend. Yeah, well, I don't think they have to worry too much about that kind of stuff. Whoa, look at that. Because at the end of the day, I doubt they've seen ships from other empires for, as I said, a very long time. But who knows? Right. Still not getting... Oh, did I... I didn't fucking move his crystal properly, did I? Of course I didn't. That would require some kind of competence. Alright. So, let's move on. What else do we have? Well, whatever was here has been destroyed. What are these? Ooh, A-grade fish. Very nice. And they don't run from us either. Well, I mean, you know, they move very slowly. So I guess we should capitalize on as many of those as we possibly can. Uh, there we go, blue. Cutlass Fury on the glooper. Everybody else have at it. Now, how much do we get for a glooper? Okay, you know, definitely worth it, but not a huge amount. Ooh, look at these things. 
They're like bigger than our ship. Well, if they're worth it, then I can collect more of these off camera. So let's keep going. We're coming up to the barrier there. Oh, go for one pass through. Really? Really? Okay, well these incredibly rare, super luxurious fish apparently are everywhere, so that's good news. Enrique's critical hit doesn't actually kill one of those things in one hit. That's curious. Very curious. Alright, it's bloody fish. There we go. Nice. Yeah, good amount of gold. Hopefully our currency is still valid where we're going, because that would be a little bit awkward otherwise, wouldn't it? Oh. Here we go. Hey, do you hear anything? I mean, besides the wind. Now that you mention it, I can hear something. I'm not sure what it is. It's quite the Armada. Ooh, dragon chips. They look cool. What the? Ooh. Ah! It just came out of nowhere and attacked us. It looks like we're going to have to take them down. Battle stations, let's go. Yeah. Hey, guys. <laughs> Best way to introduce yourself. Tenku ship. Unlike your primitive ship, our vessel can fly at high altitudes. Behold the power of the east. We might have primitive uh, weapons, sure. Uh, or primitive engines, I should say. But I'm pretty sure our weapons far outshine anything you have. Let's go for some gear grease. Gear grease. Um... Gear grease. And then magic. We will get an Ingram. Let's teach these th these guys a thing or two about us from the West. Your ships look cool, but uh, I'm going to wager we're way more technologically advanced. Maybe they can go through the Dark Rift. Well, that was not that impressive. Try harder, dude. Much harder. Let's see what they're made of. They do have very cool ship designs, though. Very cool. It appears that uh, yeah, Photoman ships can climb to great altitudes. Our cannons can't reach them. Vase, our cannons may not be able to, but I'll bet our torpedoes can. We should try firing those as often as possible. Yeah. Uh, so what we will do is attack with a heavy torpedo. We'll give them some advanced cannon. Some of that. Uh, and I guess we'll pop a deluxe kit. Now hopefully, they're not out of range of our cannons. But we shall see. Hoo hoo hoo! Oh, you do not like that. Your ship is much more fragile than mine. Yeah, look at that. He's actually... They've gained altitude on us now. 
Yeah, you would have thought that those cannons would be able to gimbal up, but I guess not. Now that's starting to sting. That's okay, we can just keep healing. He's coming back down to our level. Either that or we've risen to face him. Um, let's go for some advanced cannons. Ah, hang on. Right, advanced cannon. Heavy torpedo impact. You. I want you to increm us first turn. And maybe advance, or oh, instead of advanced cannon, let's go for the 10 inch cannon. If things do get dire, which I don't think they will, we do have a complete kit. Luckily, our ship is armoured to hell and back. Yeah, she can't take many knocks from that. Torpedoes away! Hit him with the cannons again. Come on. Yeah, that hurts. That hurts. How does that feel? Evasive action. Yeah, that's what I thought. Right. You know? Let's just finish him off. Let's go with the heavy torpedo. And we will pop a Dulux kit. going to say they're not going to be able to stand up against much more of our punishment. Good night. Hey, levels all round. Almost. Pyro bomb and a crystal ball. Who's next? The Ying Yang. What appears to be the enemy's flagship is approaching. Wow. There are two boats. No, one boat. No, there's two, I think. Looks like they're planning to board us. All hands on deck. Get ready to repel boarders, bastards. Okay. Oh. Wow, we're almost out of time here, guys. Uh, so I think I'm going to leave it here. <laughs> when we come back, I guess we're going to go and repel borders. This should be fun. Was there anything actually in here? This is where Marco snuck aboard. Yeah. Yeah. So we're going to leave it here, guys, because we're on half an hour, like I said. When we come back, like I said, looks like we're going to be throwing some uh, bags overboard, if you get my meaning. Till then, thanks for watching.